Hi, I'm Tony Reinch. I'm from Nebraska, and I'm here today because I'm joining the uh, Big Yield sales team. Originally from South Central Nebraska, and I currently live in the west, on the west side of Omaha. A little bit about my background is I grew up on a farm, worked in a uh, seed corn operation for many, many years. And then after college, I went back into the uh, egg chemical, managed retail in Fairmont, Nebraska for a few years. And in that retail, we had a couple of uh, spray planes. And then after that, I had my own crop consulting business where I managed that along with a friend of mine for several years, sold the business to him, moved to the Fremont, Nebraska, Omaha, Nebraska area. And I've been working with the uh, egg chemical, egg fertilizer business pretty much ever since. Uh, something about the Big Yield that really impressed me was they had products that they want to save the, the farmer money, save the farmer time, and make that farmer money. That is very impressive because when commodity prices are low as they are right now, anytime you can help that person save money, save time, or, or make them money, it's a benefit to that farmer. So it's a, in a circle, it's a benefit for everybody. Then that's the conventional side. Along with it, what really impressed me the last couple of years that I've been uh, working with John and Bill and Derek and everybody here, I've known John and Bill for almost nine years now, just watching them, how they have taken their products and improved them and the lengths they go to make sure that the products that they sell are viable products in the marketplace. I've been around mar uh, products for many, many, many years and some of them work, some of them don't. Uh, some of them work specifically here, but not here. The organic, uh, back to the question of uh, what interested me, was the different products that they have. Combine that with the organic products that they have. Organics is a growing business every year, and even in Nebraska, I've been seeing a lot of, Nebraska, Iowa, South Dakota, Minnesota, a lot of organic products that are growing and the acres are growing also and this is an opportunity to use my agronomic background to help the conventional people along with the organic people. I, I love agriculture. I grew up in agriculture. A lot of times people don't really find out where their heart is I did. I found it out twice. I left the farm back in the 80s when my dad told me to get off the farm because there was no money to be made to me made farming. I went into electronics, hated it, just hated it. And cool stuff, I learned a lot, but just hated it. And went back into agriculture. And then here about 10 years ago, I left agriculture, about 13 years ago, I left agriculture and I was our sales manager for a human and pet nutrition company. I traveled all over the United States, Canada. Great, great job, great people. Learned a lot about human nutrition and pet nutrition. But every time I went somewhere, I kept finding myself gravitating to the local ag industries. I was always stopping on the side of the road when I landed in LA and I, I would drive up to San Francisco. I'd be pulling over the side of the road and talking to the farmers about what, what are you guys doing here? What are you growing here? How are you applying fertilizers? Or is this organic? And it finally just struck me on a flight home one time from Portland, Oregon, that my heart is still in agriculture. And when your heart is in agriculture, you will find a way to make things work. That's why I decided to stay with agriculture. Uh, how people can get a hold of me, they can give me a call on my cell phone number or drop me an email. And the best way to get a hold of me is dropping me a text on my cell phone number. And it's 402-957-0412. The reason I don't have a lot of people leave messages because my travels take me to Timbuktu and there's no signal. For some reason, text messages get through. But if they wanna leave a long message and it might be a few hours when I get back to them, but uh, text or phone call is the best. 
email would be about the third way. 